international customers, Raytheon puts a lot of emphasis on its international partners. To talk about this, I'm joined by Joe D'Antona, Vice President of Air and Missile Systems at Raytheon, and Hans Hagen, who's the Vice President of Business Development at Kongsberg Defence and Aerospace Systems. So, Joe, to start with, why are international partners so important to Raytheon? Well, as you know, Raytheon is a worldwide company. Uh, we work in all regions of the world, and our job is to provide an integrated solution to our customers. We also recognize that our customers will rarely use our products uh, by themselves. They're going to be part of a larger coalition or an alliance uh, when they find themselves in conflict. Our job is to provide the best integrated solutions that we can at the low cost with the best technology available. Raytheon uh, provides that capability with our internal packages, but also by partnering uh, with very well-respected international partners. In Europe alone, one-third of our international partners come from Europe. Uh, among them are PGZ in Poland, Rheinmetall in Germany, and Kongsberg in Norway. And Hans, from Kongsberg's perspective, how have you partnered with Raytheon and how have you kept that partnership successful? So the partnership with Raytheon, the transatlantic partnership with Raytheon and Kongsberg goes way back in time, all, all the way back to 1968. And through all these years, uh, we have learned to know each other as organizations. We have learned to know each other technologies and uh, actually on all levels, you know, engineers cooperate, business development departments cooperate and leadership uh, cooperate. And this has brought us through times of hardship, but also a lot of successes. And that's what we're building on now. And especially through this NASAMS uh, air defense system, where we are inter interdependent on each other. Raytheon brings some components, Kongsberg some components. And we see now that in the marketplace, this NASAM system uh, attracts a lot of international customers, uh, worldwide actually. And most of the customers per today is in Europe and our NATO customers. And we will then uh, continue on this uh, NASAM's uh, evolution, like we call it, because the system is actually on the path of evolution. And with the open architecture in the system, we can integrate a lot of different components in, especially the Raytheon family of missiles. So today we have a demonstrated integration of AIM-9X, AMRAM uh, missiles and AMRAM extended range. And this is uh, one of the uh, things we will uh, uh, highlight in the marketplace uh, in the years to come. Brilliant. Well, thank you both so much for your time. Thank you.